Investigators still searching for the suspect who shot an L.A. County Sheriff's deputy at a station packed with other deputies. That shooting happened yesterday on Jackman Street and Sierra Highway. It's in Lancaster. KCAL 9's Cara Finstrom reports the deputy was moments from taking off his protective, protective gear when he was shot. Fortunately, the sheriff's department tells us that wounded deputy has been treated and is back home with family, but they are still looking for the shooter who they tell us boldly fired into this parking lot, which is very close to the sheriff's station. We spoke with a woman who says she was here at the time. That look on that officer's face, I will never forget it. She had a panic look. Carol Garcia was inside the sheriff's station yesterday afternoon when she heard a single pop. Within seconds, she says, deputies were running everywhere. Uh, take a shot from the north of the Lancaster helipad. Up here in the right shoulder. Just outside in the parking lot, 21-year-old deputy Angel Reynosa was radioing for help. He'd been shot. From the apartment complex to the north, I got two shots off. My sister's to the right. That was just all kind of cars coming with officers putting on their vests and she, we were just looking over this brick wall over there. The deputies raced to help, not knowing if they too could be in the line of fire. Reynosa was taken to the hospital with a shoulder wound. The mayor said a bulletproof vest helped protect him. What he was doing was getting ready to take that vest off. Had he done so, this would be a much more tragic situation. SWAT team members moved into the nearby apartment complex and searched it and nearby streets for hours. Two people were detained but later released. Garcia says responding officers told her to get far away, but her 16-year-old was inside, about to be transported to a juvenile detention center. But I was like, I'm not leaving till somebody tell me that my kid is okay. By the early morning hours, she got that word, and the sheriff's department confirmed Deputy Reynosa had been treated and released. Detectives have not yet released any information about a possible suspect. There are security cameras here everywhere. We have not yet heard back from investigators, so we don't know exactly what they captured, but hopefully they recorded something that can help in this investigation. Reporting here from Lancaster, Cara Finstrom, KKL 9 News.